just look at this absolutely stunning 2017 Audi A4 2 litre TDI Ultra S line just arrived today at MSC Motors. I've always been a massive BMW fan, but this Audi really has converted me. Didn't think it would be an Audi A4 event that it would take to convert me, uh, but it really is. I'm so impressed by it, not just in terms of spec, but the way it drives, the way it handles. It's in lovely condition. You've got front parking sensors, alloy wheels are also in really good condition just been serviced, just been MOT'd and it's also passed with no advisories. Last year it had the gearbox serviced, which is extremely important on these, so fresh gearbox oil and filters. It's a lovely colour. Now we can also help with sort of going doing a black pack on these. So if you wanted black alloys, rear windows tinting, the badges going black and the honeycomb front grille with the black inserts and we can help arrange that as well. It's got the rear parking sensors as well as the front parking sensors and look at this for a nifty bit of kit as well electronic boot if we open it you see as the boot opens parcel shelf also slides up as well really impressed by that 60 40 split on the rear seats as well it's the electronic boots it's got both of its keys with it as well again that rear alley in great condition and plenty of tread on that rear tyre. Drives lovely. Plenty quick enough. The gearbox is nice and smooth. The seats are extremely comfy again. Loads of tread on that front tyre. And that wheel there also in great condition. It's got built in sat nav, Bluetooth, Apple CarPlay, DAB radio. Take a little look at the back seats. Back seats are in really nice condition. Got an armrest that comes down just here as well, as you can see there. It's nice Alcantara on the door panels. Three way air conditioning as well. Obviously, electric windows all the way around. The carpet mats are even in lovely condition as well. You've got the extendable front seats. No nasty stains or rips in there on the seats at all. Obviously the S in Boston to the rear of the seat rest. The automatic headlights as well. 57,814 miles on the clock. Put my foot on the brake and press the start button. Let's just go no on there again. Another little bit of clever kit. Over onto the radio. Got your DAB radio over onto your media, external audio player. So you've got Bluetooth, AUX on there as well. We've got sat nav, obviously, all your different drive mode selects as well. And then if we press auto on there, you've got three zone climate control, heated front seats. Definitely don't need those on in this weather. A nice, sleek little gear lever, electronic parking brake, cruise control as well. Just going to turn the aircon off so you can actually hear me. If we pop her over into reverse, you can see the parking, uh, parking sensors come up on the screen just there. And you've got all your driver assist on here as well. Another clever little thing it does. So if you're approaching a roundabout, it will tell you to let off the accelerator to save fuel. And if you're going too close to the car in front and you're not braking in time, it will also warn you for that as well. Just gonna pop the hazard lights on and leave the engine running and jump back out. Just so I can show you the sequential indicators as well. Really like those on this car as well. Lovely sequential indicators just there. And while the sun's shining, through that little gap, you can really see the metallic fleck in the paint as well. So it is a lovely car. Obviously, it's not brand new, so I'm going to have a couple of little stone chips here and there. And the odd little, maybe a little tiny little scratch here and there. But as you can see, it is a lovely car. Like I mentioned before, if you do want the front grille replacing with a black one and black front al and black alloys, then we can help arrange that as well. Lovely car. If you do have any questions about parts exchanging your car or about finance, about warranties, then please do just give us a call. And thank you very much for watching.